Title of this story is, Am I the astronaut for what I told my mother-in-law when she asked to be in the delivery room? My husband, male 33, and I, female 30, are expecting a baby boy. We're barely catching up with preparation and getting everything ready. His mom, kind of a busybody type but can be helpful at times, invited us for dinner and said she has an important request to make. She brought up her request at the dinner table and blatantly said that she wanted to be in the delivery room with me when I gave birth. I was taken aback by her request. I really thought it had something to do with the nursery or diaper brand. I said I was sorry, but only my mom and my husband will be there. She made a face, got quiet for a minute, and then brought it up again. She just kept pushing, saying she is as much of a grandmother as my mom and that she just wanted to be there for support and to get the opportunity to see her grandbaby's first moments. My husband sided with her. Oh hubby what have you done i just stared at her and said it's all right you can have the opportunity to be in the delivery room when it's your son who's giving birth oh snap like literal everyone stopped eating my mother-in-law left the table instantly my husband got me up although i wasn't finished with dinner and he said we should leave in the car he lost it on me asking what brain cell made me think it was a good idea to tell his mom that i told him his mom kept pushing after i had already given her an answer still he said this was the most effed up thing he'd heard me say i replied that i was just frustrated and didn't mean to hurt her feelings and cause issues he argued that if i don't want issues then i should stop making shit difficult and just say yes to his mom's request bro so what are you doing here man what are you doing here going ahead and giving him the bros over reward there he then ranted about how it's his son too and then said if his mom isn't allowed in there then he won't be there too oh that'll solve everything good job now i don't know if he really meant this or just said it in the heat of the moment but it had me fuming he's been ignoring me when i try to talk to him and act like i'm not in the room i think i might have gone too far and created tension by responding inappropriately Am I the Askonaut? Edit, there has been some tension between me, my husband, and his family lately. This probably blew up because of built up resentment. Built up resentment about what? What the hell are you doing? Okay, so uh, my belief about who gets to be in the room or who should be in the room is whoever the person that is delivering the baby needs there for support, right? I understand her wanting to be there to see the first few moments, but it feels like she is really prioritizing the competition between her and OP's mom. She doesn't like the fact that OP's mom is going to see the baby before she does or hold the baby before she does. I feel like it's less about being there for support and more about not being there last, which sucks. This was a stupid brozo thing for hubby to do. And he is being manipulated by his mom. He's pulling the mama's boy shit here. He is not siding with his wife. He's choosing his mom, which is a very stupid thing to do. He's going to land himself in divorce court here soon. And his baby's not even here yet. Like, bro, bro, choose your wife. And understand that the people in the room are there to support the person who's pushing another human out of their body, not those who are just part of the making of process. And yes, it's her grandchild too, but she's not going to be able to do anything for the grandchild. The grandchild isn't going to know if she's there or not. So that this argument is invalid. It's whoever the person who is pushing the other human out of their body, whoever they need there for support is who gets to be there. You don't get to just push your way in because you don't want to be last. If he wants to get in the stirrups and spread his legs and let let OP's mom come inspect him, then that's a fair deal. But also, he'd have to be pushing something ginormous out of his body during the process. And then it comes with luggage that nobody warns you about the first time. It comes with luggage. That placenta is like an alien egg that comes out afterwards. It's like, I didn't know this kid brought luggage. I didn't know it had a, a suitcase with it. Was not informed. That was a brozo move. The question here from OP was, am I the astronaut for what I told my mother-in-law when she asked to be in the delivery room? I'm NTA here. She kept pushing. Pun intended again. She pushed and she pushed and she pushed. And uh, she got a reaction. 